Is he going to get the fling? It's virtual, he throws to the side. Freddy gets a Lulu ultimate down on him as the Zyra ulti knocks them all in the air. Slayer being absolutely destroyed as Fence Current comes in as well. There was the Lulu ultimate, it wasn't used earlier on. Bjergsen is going to kill virtual though. Freddy going low, Nigod Pro going low. No, no, he's finished off. Karalias and Freddy are the only two men left alive here. God Pro is still somehow alive in this one as he flings Freddy away again. Can we see a what for a kill? Can he get the Penta kill here? Bjergsen chasing. Chasing down. Oh, he's missing just about, but there's Give it to Penta. Penta coming in for Bjergsen. And Copenhagen Wolves are going to push through here and pick up their first victory in the LCS Europe. Oh, and he's picked him on the wall. Is it going to be enough? The Zara Ultimate comes out. No, oh. oh my god, Bjergsen goes back in a rip walk and fourth pulse. And down goes Jimbo. Copenhagen Wolves are still in as they need to defend this inhibitor tower. The hook lands into an area. The hook goes on towards Enrated. Oh, brilliant ultimate there from Svenska. But is the damage down? You can see Peke goes in, gets that death load to stun. Soaz gets dropped by the test off the screen here. Cyanide now in trouble. Cyanide goes down. Copenhagen Wolves turning the fight around. Yellow Star's going to get dropped. He goes down. Now on towards Peke. Peke goes down. It's four tails down. Can Triple he do it again? for Bjergsen. He's going to go on towards Enrated. He gets the quadra kill. And they're going to pile down the middle on towards the Inhibitor. Pro gets flung over, but is that really the target that they want to go for? He gets away with the lantern, wow. but look at the damage that Wolves have done in the meantime. Here comes Jarvin, Intervention gets put down, but will they be able to go through? Boxers in position, Dexter goes down, Shushi goes down. Where's the next target? They're going to go in towards Hosan. He's taking a lot of damage. Surely will be finished off here. Yamato Cannon suffers the same fate in the reset to Bjergsen. Absolutely ripping them to pieces. Quadra kill comes down. And that will be an ace for Copenhagen Bulls. I think he thought the timing on the Zonyas was wrong, but even I knew that was up for a little bit longer. And that is a big, important ultimate down, and NIP are going to know that. Aim towards Freeze, we'll see whether it lands on there. Oh, going close in, there's going to be the wave. Is it going to be enough? The Aqua Prism doesn't land, Chain of Corruption does so. And that's going to be Froggen actually teleporting in the back. Blue buff there, here there. Maluno taking low, Wicked managed to get a Lightning Surge and does manage to get a Slicing Maelstrom off. He gets taken down though, Freeze taken very low. EG all low at the moment, they just drop quickly. Bjergsen picks himself up a double on towards Froggen. Froggen taken very low, he can't even get onto Maluna. He's just being kited around the map. That's a triple kill for Bjergsen. Fantastic play for NIP. As I say that, they thought about going for it there, but actually, Bjergsen getting up behind Bjerg Peke here. Does put a bunch of damage down, switches out the charm, misses, that's wow. going to be Peke dead. Deathmark will finish him off, splat. Card was pulled, but it's not going to be enough. There's a death mark down, but Makata's in there as well. There's a flash, though. Bjergsen goes around, then jumps away. Amazing from Bjergsen. He's not finished yet. He's actually going to fight Makata. Stan United coming in as well. Oh, and there is the slide over the wall. That would have been the play of the week by a very, very long way if they'd have picked up that kill as well. Now Kubon's coming oh, over, and he actually did manage to catch him, but Got the salt here he comes, Shenton! Coming down, Shenton stops it! And NIP, the coordination between just these two players right now. Well, that's the thing, isn't it? Where's he going to go? Well, death mark down. He uses the shadow to get away, and there comes Mimer. Bjergsen back in for this one. Who are they going to go for? Bjergsen going very low. Here is the Requiem coming out as well. Bjergsen not dead from that one, and he's still having to go. Charu going to go down. Flash comes in. Makla's going to die as well. Mimer now still alive. He'll take a chunk of damage. No, he won't from Kog'Maw. 
They're trying to rush it down, but Ferenlo's been caught out. Hasn't used the shockwave yet. He's holding his nerve. And that's going to be Maluno. The shockwave only catching on Deficio. Stranglethorns, meanwhile, bounces up three members. Jerry gets caught. That's the death mark onto Creator. Pierce is going to try and get it. He finishes it. Picks up a double kill. Ferenlo gets in. It's a triple kill. Arane is going to get taken down. Pierce gets a quadra. Quadra kill for Pierce and comes in like Superman. Absolute decimation from Pierce. Gonna jump towards him. That's actually, if they'd have hold the nerve a little bit longer, they would have found a much juicier target. Doesn't matter. Cataclysm comes in. Jerry locked up. He's gonna have to use his party, but it's too late. And that's gonna be Maluno that get locked in. Look at Bjergs and he's in the back line. Greton goes down. For Elnord, Ace in the hole ain't gonna save you, son. You're gonna go down. It's a double for Bjergsen. They are just trouncing through alternate.